Hello everyone, and welcome to the 2022 Me Invitational Patch Notes. Yeah, that's right, we are going to do this again, and yeah, thanks for noticing. That is the creative director and the esports director playing in our tournament, which means these notes, they're pretty much official. Checkmate, Ubisoft. So, strap yourselves down, tune in, and prepare yourselves for 12 months of changes coming to Rainbow Six Siege, including operator, map, and ba 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 No, not here, not on this one. Rainbow Six Siege Patch Notes map balances, and this we 100% wanted to listen to the community for. So we took to social media, took in all of the complaints and the questions that were coming our way, and baked it into a delicious vintage pie to give you that reminisce about how Siege used to be, with two very major changes. Night mode. Yeah, we're bringing it back, but we had to make a couple of changes to ensure that the game stayed to a smaller size. So now, the skybox is randomly going to change from day to night within a single map. It might feel like you're in that weird part of Scandinavia where day and night seemingly last either forever or not at all, but you'll get used to it, and it'll give you that sweet taste of vintage siege as you try and peek a window without being able to see anything, and then suddenly being able to see too much, oh god, your eyes burn. The second is Old Hereford. Now it is the face of Siege, and it's sad to see it go and we agree, so we wanted to make sure that we had that smiling face down on you on every single Siege map. We're taking the top floor of Hereford and putting it on every single map, and inside there, Bandit and Jaeger with ACOGs on realistic difficulty. Once again you can feel that feeling of, where was I shot from? Oh god it could have been any of these windows, I fucking hate them. And finally, as tradition, we'll be moving around some of the hatches and reinforced walls. But we won't tell you which ones. We'll leave it for the esports players to work out. We know they love to. The new operator. And we wanted to make sure that we listen to the community. And we hear you out there. Those that are a little bit tired of the futuristic gadgets, the gizmos, the way we're leaning into the sparks and the sparkles, and the deep intrinsic lore of our characters. So instead, with this new one, I went ahead and fired all of the creative and the writing team, and have developed John Smith, a man who has absolutely no noticeable characters or qualities at all. What does he do? I don't know. Bringing a Phillips and a flathead and some hand sanitizer to the game, he's going to make sure that he shows up, does a job quite nondescriptly, and then leaves so nobody can complain about him. And this brings us nicely along to skins. And we put our heads together this time, and really thought, what's going to make us the most amount of money? Really an unending amount would be preferable. And outside of NFT minting pictures of Intero just to piss him off, we think we've cracked it this time. Introducing our new skin range, Furries and Weebs. Yeah, that's right, we've opened the gates of hell and let everything flood in to make sure we get a consistent beam of currency right through the hearts of every single player and our pockets. You may be wondering, how do we sleep at night knowing that this is what we've put into the game? On a bed of money. We're also introducing a new esports skin, this time of an esports player. Comfortable joggers, a loose t-shirt, a tattoo arm sleeve, no sleep and an energy drink, and you're good to go. Just be careful if you buy the Team OXG one, because that one will bankrupt you. Now you may be wondering what this patch is called. Well, I can reveal it's called the Community Patch, with unity and bold, and calm at the start but not in the Parker and Milos way. We wanted to make sure that we had a representative from the community to talk about the requests that people desperately need. And, well, we found one, but we'll keep their identity anonymous to protect them. Hey, yo, what's up? It's me, Medix. Oh, shit, shit, fuck. My, my bad, my bad. Moan drones. Um, what? Uh, it's drones that moan. And that was all he said for 30 minutes, so expect those soon. Quality of life, and we finally added a walkthrough tutorial of every single default hold on every single comp map. Yeah, it's taken a bit of time, but we got there, okay? And we've got there with style, because you don't just have one option, but multiple of how you'd like to learn. The first is the easygoing and ever-loving Ace of Pyrite. Whoa, 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 lesion, lesion, come on, come here, let me show you. You want the one on the right reinforced, and then it's a rotation in the one on the left. And if you'd like something a little bit closer to the true ranked experience, we also asked our EUL analyst desk, Jess and Fresh, to see if they could give their own. Whoa, well, Legion, what the fuck do you think you're doing? It's the wall on the other side, come on. It's the wall on the right, a rotate goes this side. What the fuck do you actually think you're doing? We also tried to get a version recorded by your average tier 4 National League player, but every single time we tried, they ended up being banned for toxicity. 
And before we close, just a very quick litany list of things that we're going to do to change the game up that we've maybe taken from other places. El Arcane is a new show about two sisters that love each other but fight quite a lot that we're going to be bringing. We're also going to be removing the gender lock on all items and outfits, so anybody can now wear anything with any animation. Also, Pengu, lovable caster, well, once player and content creator in between that, what else can this Dane do? We're going to find out and give him a litany of odd jobs in and amongst the game. He's now the support staff, the social media manager, and the anti-cheat guy, so tweet him with all of your problems. We're going to replace Kaid with Milos just to see what happens, and we're also going to see if we can make a roguelite. We're not really sure what that is, but they're popular, so we're going to try and throw one in. But the most important part and the thing you're all probably waiting for, what are we going to do about the anti-cheat and hackers? Well, you see the ping in the group chat. It's time for ranked and come get the stack. The vibes are high, sugar too. It's time to swing peak doors, get out of plateau. What's these maps? Oh, sun, Oregon club and consular. Dub. Monty Cap can, that's kind of sus, but we'll do with it just what we must. The communique, everything's great. The mics are hot, drop lock, ready to slay. There's 10 reinforcements in the right place. Then you haven't been blocked by your castle main. Wait, what's that in the distance, Buck? Did I just die through three sauce luck? They're spinning round, nothing to do. Oh fuck, it's happened again, we're up against Hackers Children who have nothing better to do And they're shit at the game, so they're ruining it for you Hackers We need a new ooh, anti cheat please The game is the best that it's ever been Apart from this disease they call themselves Hackers but really they're just some kids with 20 bucks A mistake from when their parents who don't love them went and fucked Hackers Game up the game, I'm going insane. It's the same few names, so here's my system that I'm going to explain. I don't hack, we're just in the lame, same lobby and queued. You're in dine with a 0.1 KD, you can't be boosted and thought LFT, you banned. I only hack because other people hack. Wow, real noble. Just admit you're bad at the game and leave the server. In fact, I'll do it. You're banned. Hitting you hot with a new solution to get some much needed retribution. Anime banned, barcode gone. Blitz main, come on man, don't make me yawn. Anyone under 18, you're out too. You've got school, so fuck you. People who say easy, all right, you can stay. Unless you're under 0.8. Hackers Just gonna ban the lot of you For random rules I'll invent on review Just because Fuck you Hackers Sell their details to every telemarketer that exists And add them to loads of police watch lists Hackers I know I changed the chorus a bit then But just wanna reaffirm Hackers parents do not love them again Hackers we need a new ooh, anti cheat, please, and the game is the best that it's ever been. So I'll take this on myself and ban just a load of people. Just really loads of people. They're gone. <laughs>